be ready start your imperial majesties have given our people the opportunity of welcoming you on other occasions in the past as well similarly our leaders have visited your great country on numerous occasions the exchange of views which have been made possible by these visits have invigorated the multi dimensional relationship that exist between india and iran with every high level visit that has been exchanged between our two countries it has been possible to enlarge areas of cooperation and complementary and come closer together in our attitude to our and world problems we have no doubt whatsoever that the present visit will impart further dynamism and vitality to the process of beneficial cooperation and mutual understanding between our two countries the culture and traditions of our two countries have much in common india's contacts with iran go back many thousand years in history and legends there has been a continuous interleave of thoughts beliefs and ideas between the two countries anciently pahlavi and modern persian are akin to us symbolizing the continuity of a great cultural tradition which has its roots in the ancient past and has influenced us and in turn has been influenced by us it is therefore not surprising that we share so much common inheritance of the way of life of our two peoples in our customs and manners arts and crafts literature and lore and above all in the common values which we have carefully nourished and cherished through the centuries it is therefore only natural that we continue to share certain attitudes in our international and bilateral issues both our countries believe in the peaceful settlement of disputes through friendly discussions in our relations with our neighbors we have both consistently tried with the sincerity and goodwill to foster ties of friendship and good neighborliness iran has been experiencing a phenomenal transformation under the dynamic and far sighted leadership of your imperial majesty and a social and cultural uplift under the inspiration of her imperial majesty retaining the abiding values of a great civilization your country is marching forward to reap the benefits of scientific and technological advancement the remarkable progress achieved by iran during the recent years stands testimony to your wisdom foresight and able stewardship it can be truly said that the far reaching economic endeavors which were inspired by your imperial majesty are and will continue to 
bear fruit in the future in the evolution of an iran holding its head high among the advanced nations of the world india too has gone through momentous developments the people of india have proved that they cherish their liberty above everything else after the massive mandate which our people have given to the present government a great responsibility rests upon our shoulders we are bending our energize and applying all our strength for quickening the pace of progress in the country and to give material content to our political liberty in this achievement we recognize the value of assistance and cooperation which we have received from iran under the personal interest and direction of your imperial majesty regrettably the world today countries to present a disconcerting picture of contrasts and disparities this is the gravest threat to international peace and security deprivation cannot coexist without inviting questioning discontent and frustration the gulf between the haves and have notes must be bridged if we wish this planet to remain peaceful and stable it is therefore the duty of all of us to ensure that we make this planet a better place for succeeding generations through progressive elimination of disparities and want and achievement of all round and accelerated progress of the underdeveloped world each of us has his own role to play according to capacity and capability it is only through collective efforts that we will be able to succeed in this context we would like to pay a tribute to your imperial majesty's own efforts in helping to undertake ventures of common benefit on the basis of bilaterals your imperial majesty has crusaded for the removal of barriers restricting the flow of trade commerce and communications between the developed and the developing countries your effort for mitigating the present world economic situation is a measure of your statesmanship as well as of your deep understanding of the complementary of the economic forces of the world i am firmly of the view that both our countries can play a significant role in broadening the trend for greater harmony and understanding between the north and south between our two countries the possibilities of cooperation are virtually limitless we are happy to observe that many of the projects envisaged by our governments earlier are now taking concrete shape their full realization will certainly generate a momentum in the industrial economic and technological fields to the mutual benefit of the two countries in this context the indo iran joint commission meeting held in new delhi in september this year proved 
fruitful and has opened up new vistas for cooperation which must be followed up with expedition and determination my government is convinced that a constructive relationship based on political understanding will make for real stability full stop